Hi guys, welcome back to another Steam Free to Play review. Today we have Mercury Blue mini episode. And I've never played this Jake game. Hunter, a so called flashbang. A but it looks good. The known universe in a clap of thunder. The origins of which remain a mystery to the residents of the galaxy. Okay. Found by FU2, his soon to be FU2. Royal Alliance droid <laughs> and surrogate parent. He was raised to become an elite Alliance fighter pilot who went on to defend the galaxies against the evil corporation Conglomo Corp. Led by the infamous Vandros, who conducted his reign of terror from his mighty starship, the Atlas, Atlas Red. Red. During a mighty battle to save the planet Solaria 6 from the vice-like grip of Conglomo Corp, Jake's girlfriend Angelica was killed by Vandros. No. Prompting Jake to quit the alliance oh, no. and start a one-man <laughs> mission of Jeez, revenge guys. against the Overlord. So, with his loyal sidekick FU2 by his side, a stack of old Growling Stone magazines, and his favorite pair of anti-residue space pants, Captain Jake Hunter set off across the galaxy in his ship, the Mercury Blue. And although he didn't realize it at the time, not only would Jake find justice, but he had begun an adventure that would ultimately unveil his true identity. God, he's got a strong jaw, man. That jaw is jutting out. Seems like the story for Outlaw Star were um, Helga oh, dies. Man. Lucky we found this planet before the fuel ran out. The tanks are drier than my Aunt Susan's skin condition. Uh -huh. Yes, this is quite a fight. I'm surprised my scanners picked the system up at all. And here I thought the only thing you were good for was beer pong and making human jobs redundant. And don't forget cleaning up after you. Don't forget the cleaning. Okay, I thought this was supposed to be kid friendly. <laughs> Don't forget the cleaning. Right, Captain. First things first. Before heading out onto the planet's surface, that's a tutorial. A tutorial task. We need no, to please. Your first task is to search the ship for equipment before heading outside. Uh, okay. Well, at least you're accepting that as a you tutorial. You can check out your current task list by uh -huh. clicking on the inventory icon at the top left corner of your screen. Okay. You see it there? Yeah, no, I don't. Right to your left. Uh, yeah, I don't see it. Got it. Find the key to the locker. Nicely read, Captain. Oh my God. You even <laughs> up this time. Thanks, man. As you can see from your assignments, first you'll have to collect the key to the locker. Got it. To add the key to your inventory, first hover the mouse over the object located on the desk to your right. Then click on it. Thank you. I see why it's read E for everybody now. Thank you. Can I take it? Great. Now combine the key with your key tag located in the inventory by clicking on it. Way to go, Way to sir. go, me. Just Gosh. try not to lose them again. Now, let's head down to the locker. This is going to be really annoying. This is how the whole tutorial Finally, goes. To access the locker, simply select the key from the inventory, <laughs> then click on it once more on the locker uh, to open it. Okay. See? And then you graduated. That's it. It's open. Thanks. Whoa. Bravo, Captain. Bra Bravo. You're definitely a lot smarter than you look. Fight me, dude. I guess I don't look very smart. You're now free That's fair. to explore the rest of the ship and the planet. Best of luck. That was it? And remember, okay. if you Whatever. need That's me, fine. I'm always here to provide smart ass okay. commentary. That is not rated E language, my dude. <laughs> not at all. I'm trying not to cuss because it's rated E. No, you're over here. I thought I saw something interesting in the locker. Let's check that out. Brutus was the brawn in the gang. What he lacked intact, he more than made up for in loyalty. He was the bravest Alliance pilot I ever met. Selena was a highly skilled spy and tactics expert. If you needed highly classified info on the enemy, she had it. Talon. Now that guy was volatile. Extremely talented weapons expert. Kind of kept to himself, though. Hmm. Those guys were the best pilots in the Alliance. That day, God, took back Solaria 6 from Conglomo Corp. Then, uh, lost it again three months later. That's when I realized I was fighting a lost cause and got the hell out. 
and abandon them to die. Valeria was a majorly talented pilot. She could fly a trash can into a battle and still win if she had to. And she actually had to a couple of times. That's everybody, I guess. Make sure we can't click on all of the asteroid freaking generic enemies over there. Just go. Interact. Nice. A Pika X9. Good for spying on the neighbors. And you just know they're up to no good. How do I know that? Star Fox. Star Ferret. Star Ferret. I love that game. That's Dingo Star. I love Star, Star Fox the actor for real. Plays the lead role. I used to idolize that guy. He's the reason I wanted to become a pilot. That's Fun cool. Fun fact, he's not actually a ferret. He's a dingo. Wow. This is Falco. This is... Which one's Slippy? Would that be Slippy and that would be Peppy? I'm guessing. Falco, Slippy, Peppy. And then Fox. I haven't seen the cover in a long time though, so that's just guessing at it. Eh, not right now. Okay. Can I not move the camera? I guess. The freaking not. <laughs> That's annoying. Okay. No way, man. F U2 would kill me. Okay, thanks, dude. F U2, what a name. <laughs> Mantra Prime. Now that is one hot rock. If this moon were any closer to Dennis, it would melt. Man, I hope I never have to go there for any reason. Me too. Extremely hot. I remember extremely hot stage in Star Fox where the dude was like in the lava. That was ah, a hard Emerald stage. Emerald Station. To be honest. That's our next stop. If we get off this dust bowl, that is. For the right price, you can buy whatever you want there, like Bathari ice cream, the most forbidden of the flavors. Oh man, I've made a few enemies at that gas stop. Fortunately for me, it's the only place I can buy schematics for the Atlas Red. Without those, I can't sneak onto the ship and eliminate Vandros. Not the Atlas also, Red. Atlas Call it are playing their the Outlaw month, Star. So it's a no-brainer. Let me name my ship, dang it. This is the Outlaw Star, 100%. That's Bathala, a large jungle planet on the Outer Rim. Sounds like Conglomo Corp has orbital tech stationed there. No Cameronium detected, though. I wonder what they're That's a Cameronium. I know the robot was talking about it at the start, but I don't know what that means. I looked at that one. I did not look at this one. Hypathia. Cold as ice. Just like my Aunt Susan. You're as cold as ice. You're willing to sacrifice my love. That's Dragonus. The rock we're currently stranded on. <laughs> Pulling Both your the drags And in... Oh, wait. It's for the old heads. That's weird. It says Conglomo Corp quarantined the planet for some reason. Hmm. Probably because it sucks here. Not fair. Air Desert. I don't think we get to go to any of these islands because it is a mini episode. Oh. Excuse me, what is this? No need to open it just yet. That's for emergencies only. Okay. No need to open it just yet. No need to open it just yet. Okay. Thanks for letting me touch things I guess I can touch. It's so hot right now. I don't think it's worth opening without any crystals. Besides, that's hazardous work. I usually let the tin can deal with it. Nice of you. Way to be a good person. What's his name? Captain Jack something something. Generic space hero. Alright. Wow, what a dump. I already want to get out of here. Me Assuming too. we find Cameroonian crystals to power the ship, that's, that's what we need them for. Powering the ship. Screwed. Eh, let's just catch a Zuber. Huh? They don't travel out this far. Like, f never. Whoa, watch your okay, language. well, no matter. Trust me, we'll find those crystals. I haven't even cussed yet. You've cussed twice. Uh, just saying. This way. <sighs> oh my. Oh my. Uh, Captain, I've set up three observation posts uh, around the immediate area to help you scout the uh, Cameronium. Okay. Unfortunately, I uh, was unable to locate How the uh, scope attachment. It, bro. You'll need to find one yourself before you can uh, start scanning this sector for crystals. Oh, is this possibly more tutorial? Because I already got it, bro. I'm ahead of you. Well, at least the camera's not as... It's so doopy. Okay. You want some 
He showed me where I need to... Move to the touch. Can I jump? God, he runs so weird. <laughs> My precious. Okay. He did show me where the scope was, but I don't remember. No. Drunk? Probably. Like one of my superpowers. I'm always drunk. You want the scope? That's rougher than it. Hey bro, where was the scope thing at? Mm, smooth to the touch. What am I supposed to be doing again? <laughs> Other than paying off your loan shark? Locate the crystals using the scope attachment. And let me know once you've found them. Okay. Never mind. Oh wait, let me talk to ask him how his missus is. That's important information. So, how's the missus? Not well. She she keeps accusing me of pushing her buttons. <laughs> okay, that's it. Never mind. Okay, so I can use a scope on any of these, maybe? Talky thing, ain't ya? It's a tripod. Hey. Can I use this on this? Whoa! Control mouse will to zoom and any key to exit. Why would I... It's a Thanks. God. Okay, I just need to look through them one at a time, and probably the last one actually has the one that I'm supposed to be looking through. Because he's moving from thing to thing, I'm guessing. Whoa! Look at this stuff. It's stuff, alright. Now he's gonna move to the next one. Yep, thanks, man. Thanks for wasting my time. No, I'm just kidding. All good. It's all part of the game. It's pretty, like the graphics are pretty good. Oh, there they are. Found them. Bingo. That's enough Cameronium to power the ship through to the next space bar. Let's go. Can I get down there? Oh man, what do I do now? Bingo! F you too. Hey, you look that? at that dance. Yes, sir. Hey, dirt. Hey, dirt. That, uh, that looks like a long walk. You, uh, you should take supplies. Where? Nice try, Tin Can. How about you go and collect the crystals while I plot a course off this rock? Perfect. Okay, you win. See you for the show. <laughs> Am I really gonna leave him to do the heavy lifting after I just looked through some scopes? Are you kidding me? Or do I gotta play as him? That'd be interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Man, look at all these enemies. Jesus. That's five times to my zero that you've been cussing. God dang it. What is he eating? Oh, it's giving me a freaking culture. I'm trying to drink, bro. I must get a specimen. Oh, 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 wait. Oh, no. No. Well, that, 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 that didn't end well, did it? No, not really. Zero. What a mm. barbaric planet. Hey, I'm playing as a robot. I knew that was gonna happen. Give me some of that. Yeah. Oh. Nope, that's that's definitely stuck. Thanks. Funny. God. I've been working out. I've, I've upgraded the muscles in my arms. Do you not notice my my arms looking bigger? Yeah, man, you're swole. Let's see what achievements we have to get still. To be honest, I want to get all the achievements while I play through this. So I've already got three. Half a coca cuckness. Um. Bug hunt, trap a. Yeah, whatever that is. Extract crystals from the plant surface, arm jack with a weapon. Bullseye, take out the alien queen. Yeah, save it if you do. I think this is just gonna happen. Numerically. 
as long as I capture all the other things. Oh, there's a bug. I need those. Now, uh, here comes a woody line by our robot companion. Hit me with it. Oh, those bugs look kind of angry, bro. Are you no woody line? Okay. <laughs> okay, got me. It's too high. We need a way of coaxing it down. There. Okay. We're not after flowers. We're, we're after crystals. What are you, a hippie? All right, bro. Again, you fly me some more, and I'll smack you too. The crate's too heavy to pick up, but maybe I can trick the bugs by hiding behind them. Whoa! Isn't that smart? They're coming for the flowers, I would assume, so I'm gonna let them get real close to the flowers, and then I'm gonna jump out like whoa. Okay, maybe that's it. Damn, they were so quick. Dynamite, we need that. Now this looks like hundred percent, that's what we need. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I got it now, so that's always good. Well, no, not 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 interested. Besides, any explosion in in in, in here. What do you want from me, dude? It's too high. We need a way. Um, I don't know what you want, to be honest. A stack of unused conglomerate storage crates. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Yeah, wow. It's too high. We need Well, I know how to coax it down. It's catching it after I coax it down is a problem, my dude. Wait a second. Let's see if it actually goes to interact with the plants. I don't think they do though. I think they head back up before they touch the plants. They have weird pathings. That one's getting pretty close. Can I catch him? Catch him. God, they're so quick. Okay. Not quite. Bro. I mean, they're eating the plant. Strange. Not a lot of plants around here. Those insects can't seem to get enough of them, though. I know. That's not the problem, though. I'm hiding behind the freaking thing. That's not the burning issue. Oh, I hate this dude. Like, how do I get to them fast enough to catch them when they're just flying off? Maybe I can. I don't know. Maybe I wait a little bit. Let's be patient. See what happens. Cause I know that sucker right there will come. That little fat dude will come to like eat them, but. I wonder if the other guys are like keeping sight for him and if I go after they I don't know just watch this for a bit I don't want to like miss something because I'm because they fly off pretty quick once I like he's literally the only little fat dude that's eating these things Okay. Whoa, 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 that's going to cause a cave in for sure. I don't care about the cave in, dude. We're going to catch it if we. Well, no, not, not, not interested. Besides, any. Okay, maybe I'm not supposed to mess with those bugs. 
I don't want to catch one though. Wait a second. I can tell you're just randomly clicking on things now, aren't you? Yeah. I'm sure the rope will reveal its true purpose when the time. Okay. Maybe I don't catch these bugs. Maybe I got what I needed from here. I don't know. Okay. Whoa, we got something. That's that's kind of Now pick it up. Bro, I just blew one up. What happened to that? Nope, that's that's definitely stuck. Nice try, but I'm afraid that wouldn't even scratch the surface. These are strange looking plants. The bugs around here seem very attracted to their nectar. Okay. I don't think of... Just what are you trying to, uh, rope? I don't know, bro. <laughs> endless, endless jokes. Help. It's a skull from what looks to be a, a snake-like beast. Hmm. There certainly are a lot of dead creatures around here. I wonder what happened to them all. I don't know. Hmm. Acid reflux problems, eh? <laughs> I say just one drop would be enough to melt through the crystals nearby. Okay. Oh, I need that. Give me that. Oh, oh, oh my. Okay. Well, I'm uh I'm I'm sure nothing bad. Risk I'm willing to take. Grab it. Oh no. Oh god. Did I die? Oh. <laughs> Oops. Wait, I'm back. It's fine. Well, I certainly hope you're f satisfied. I'm sure you're not cruel enough to put me through uh, that experience again. Hmm. Right? Mm. Hmm? <laughs> well, that's not going to... Hmm. Hmm. Great idea. But it's too high. We need a way of getting it up there. Any four? Hmm. It's too high to reach. that it died of natural causes, although the teeth marks along its side would indicate otherwise. Thank you. Uh, let's grab it, probably. This looks like it could come in. Can I combine not things? Quite. No, of course not. Okay, now they definitely don't go together. Bro, calm down. I think. I'm not sure that would look good on my <laughs> This looks like it could come in handy. You could almost trap something in there under the right circumstances. Got it. I know what I'm doing now. Thank gosh. Okay. Jesus, this game this is a struggle. Okay. Combine these two. There. That's all to trap something interesting. Easy. Okay. Took me a little bit, but I got it. Nah, put a rope on that bad boy. Ooh, look at us. We're doing it. 
Come here, you little fuck. <laughs> we did it! Let's take a shot while we watch these little buggies go to our delicate trap. <laughs> well, I have any chaser, I don't think, but you know, every now and then you just gotta be a risky boy. Oh shit! Thank god. Almost lost it all. Too drunk. Oh shoot, I uh, cussed. Okay, it's one to like six from that robot though. Caught him. Get him. Easy. Okay, I'm drunk. Ooh wee. <laughs> Alright, we got the bug. What are we doing with the bug? Gosh, I'm. <laughs> hmm. I think we need more bang for our buck. <laughs> The dino bug! Dino bug. <laughs> <laughs> okay, boy, get up there. Great idea, but it's too hot. We need a dino bug can fly, probably, I would think. Okay, we need to light it first. Here we go, bud. No way this backfires at all. Oh, no. I do not condone this insect violence at all. <laughs> what the? That poor bug. That's freaking messed up. Alright. Hey, dude. <laughs> that's kind of. That's really messed up, to be honest. But. Look, the acid, it's, it's, it's melted and dissolved. This is all the achievements, so we're getting there. We're like two away. Thanks, man. Uh oh, we pissed something off. Wait. What's that sound? Let's just uh, get the crystal and um, get, 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 get back to the ship. That's a good Providing idea. Providing that the, the ship is, is still there and, and hasn't been eaten by a, by a giant f worm, <laughs> which, 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 let's face it, is actually likely on, on this planet, on this god awful f planet. Dude, language. Come on, man. I've only cussed once. You've cussed like 12 times. That should be enough Cameronium to get us off this godforsaken planet. Alright, Ron. If you believe in God, uh, God created all planets, so by extension, that means that he, 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 uh, he created this one too. Alright, man. Uh oh. Ron! Oh, it's coming out of that thing. I don't want it. Okay. Dragonflies. Looks like dragonflies. Oh, but... that's not good. Thanks, man. Oh, it's actual dragonflies. They look like actual dragons. Okay, Aerodactyl, calm your butt down. A while later, back at the ship. Like, what is taking my robot so freaking long? Come on, man. Exactly. Well, is FU2? That tin can was meant to be back hours ago. Come on, man. I had to think through stratagems and stuff. I got a pistol on my hip, I guess. That could be helpful ish. Yeah, I'm coming, dude. I'm here for you. Rib for your pleasure. Oh crap! The tin can is in trouble! I gotta help him! Yeah! 
I know where weapons are. Hell! <laughs> the weapons are on the ship, man. I'm going to get them. Can I take all these weapons? What? <laughs> Y'all are so SOL, my dude. Okay. Which one do I want to use, though? Y'all mess with the wrong dude's robot today. I only got one. Oh, I only got one <laughs> weapon, though. Uh, whatever. This should be good enough. Let's teach him a lesson. Click the wrong. Shut up, dude. God. I can't waste time just looking at him. He needs help. How can I get down there, dude? I need to shoot him with my pew pew. These are the schematics I've managed to piece together on Vandross's ship, the Atlas Red. We don't know where it is, and we don't know what it's capable of. I'm going to need some serious intel before I can board her and find Vandross. We don't have a lot of stats on Vandross. I do know he's about eight feet tall and a complete tool. And the complete package, really. One thing I do know, when I find him, he's gonna pay for what he did to Angelica. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh my God. What the, oh my freaking God. Kill me. I'm so pissed. Oh my god, I can't believe they really hit it right. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna have to do some editing. Fuck, are you kidding me? This game sucks. That is so... <sighs> okay. I get... Ah, uh, that's so stupid. <laughs> okay, you put it in the most... Ah, uh, aggravated. Hold on, pal. Without looking at a guy, that was probably the stupidest thing I've ever seen, to be honest. Ah, oh, that was stupid. Oh my god, can you believe it? It was literally in that menu the whole time. What the hell? I'm gonna have to delete like so much content. Gross. Oh, it gave us hard. Uh, I mean, it's an interesting game. It's really like Outlaw Star fucking ripoffish, along with not even along with Star Fox 64. It's not even close to what that was, but uh, I don't know. The game really pissed me off by putting a freaking. I can't believe I put the freaking. Yeah, I can't believe I put that right there. The ammo fuel. That really was freaking awful, to be honest. Oh, hey, I hit it. Good for me. Bullseye. Nice. Looks like I assassinated the queen. The creatures are Ooh. flying off. Nephew 2 looks pretty freaked out. I better go get him. How? We've been struggling the whole time to even get down there. I don't know how to get down there. This game's so inconsistent. How can I get down there? Let's talk about it. Pick up FU2 in the ship and get the hell off this rock. So I gotta use the ship now. Cause I obviously can't get down there myself because I've tried for like a solid hour, probably. Not even that long, but God, long enough. Come on, man. Let's 
go pick him up. Woo. So cool. Hold on, pal. I'm on my way. Why aren't we... I'm not going to question it. Help! Oh, God! Oh, God, Ron! Somebody help me, please! Help! Come on, man. You can't make the game ready to eat and have him cussing the whole time. Oh, thank God. I know I cuss a lot, but I never said myself was ready to eat, to be honest. Like, Jesus. That's strange. If I'm not mistaken, these holes are the creation of the... Yes, the giant Galactus spine worm. But they are... They only... Oh, it's a trimmer. That is not a Galactus spine worm. There's, uh, there's one behind me, isn't there? That is a trimmer creature. Oh, dear. I don't know if you guys remember trimmers from, like, the 90s. That is what that is. <laughs> Terrifying. I cannot imagine something on the ground eating me like that. Yeah, I got it. Okay, let's do this. It's not gonna be hard on that. Steady, steady. No, not hard at all. Just oh, well. Screw it. Oh well, I'll screw it. Yeah, I know. I mean, I won that trade for sure. Take that, Conglomo Corp. God damn it. There's not much skill left in this game, to be honest. After I figured out how where they put the freaking rifle fuel at. Finger of base race me? I don't think so, huh? God. Too easy. It's literally a tremor, though. Is that all the achievements? I think so. I think that's all the achievements. Hmm. Well, f this. Well, poop this. Yeah. It's not. This. Well, that was fun, right? We got fuel for the ship. You almost died. It certainly was a. It's interesting, high but it could use there. a lot of work in a lot of ways, to be honest. Our way out of that. <laughs> what do you say we go get a bite to eat? Okay, okay. I think you're digging a hole. <laughs> Even these puns are really weak. God. Uh, okay, that wasn't funny. None of them were funny. None of them were funny. That's the enemy. The actual enemy of the game. What the hell happened here? Who's responsible for this? Quickly, bring up the outpost. No way. Jake Hunter? The Mercury Blue? It, it can't be. It must be fake news. Damn it, Trump. Get it's not fake news. Line. Now. Captain Flump. Oh my god, Captain Flump and not Captain Trump. So sorry to disturb you, sir. You're going to want to see this. An alert uh, I don't think you should put political messages in your game. To be honest. Too late to intercept them. I'm pretty unbiased by like political stuff, but I don't think you should put it in your game. What? At all. But that's up to him. He's the one that made the game, and it's got like I can see the graphics would take some time for sure for a free to play game, but well done, Captain. Uh you're just off putting so many people from your fan base when your game's so niche anyways, because it's for free to play. The key is my limit in my grasp. The Alliance will not survive this. Like why would you uh why would you partisan your fucking fan base by like going into politics? I don't know, but I think that's all the achievements. Let me make 100% sure before I end this video. I think that's all the achievements. The game was I like it was just a little bit too. Yeah, I got all the achievements, but it was a little bit too convoluted on how it hid the ammo. Like, why would you put it there? And how it like really focused on some politic things that shouldn't have like Gama Corp and stuff like that but thanks for watching as always if you could please like and subscribe I love making this video so I'm gonna kind of do it regardless but I really like to see you guys any comments you have and like 
things you think about the videos. Always looking to improve. The music's really good. I like the beginning music before the game starts. But, yeah, it's kind of... game's kind of meh. I, if I did a Steam free-to-play review, I'd probably get like a 4 out of 10 because it's so short. The story's not that great. The gameplay's not that great. It's very confusing, and it, then it just tries to force this politics on you by making you versus flop, I guess. But granted, I'm pretty indifferent to politics and whatnot because I'm not smart enough to understand it. But thanks for watching, as always. Bye.